Hello, this is Daniel Mart, and today, today I'm going to be doing another review. This time around, I'm going to be doing a review for absolutely anything. That's the name of the movie. So yeah, and this movie stars Simon Pegg, Kate Beckinsale, Sanjeev Bakshar, Rob Riggle, Robert Bathurst, ba ba Bathurst, Mira Sila, Emma Pearson, and Terry Gilliam, John Cleese, Eric Idle, or Idle. Idol, idol. Um, so yeah, and Michael Palin, Palin, Terry Jones, and it is the last, uh, the last film by Robin Williams. Yeah, he is the voice of a dog. By the way, the dog's actor is Mojo. By the way, for those who don't know, uh, the dog is the dog in the film is called Dennis the dog. Robin Williams voices him, the actual actor, uh, dog they use is named Mojo. So yeah. Oh, and Brian Cox is in this film as well. So yeah, it's basically it for the, for the cast. Sad. Last film by Robin Williams. Yeah. Um, so yeah, it's basically it for the cast. Uh, as usual, quick synopsis, uh, likes and dislikes, and then the rate. But before that, I need to do my top, my 10... Second spoiler warning, as usual, for those who have yet to actually watch the movie and haven't already, stop the video, go check it out, and come back and watch the rest of this review. Ten second spoiler warning, as usual, starting now. <clears throat> okay, so ten seconds are up. So, for those who have yet to actually watch the movie and haven't already, Please don't comment down below or be messaging me. That never gave me a fair one because, as usual, I did. So, as usual, quick synopsis, like in this text, and then the rate. So, basically, in this film, you have these group of aliens, four aliens, um, and they come across a spaceship that was sent by the planet Earth. Um, and they're debating as to whether they should destroy the planet Earth or give the Earthlings a chance. So, what they do is they have this test. They say they're going to choose one random Earthling. And they're going to give him the power to do absolutely anything. And then they're going to see as to whether he's using it for good or evil. The powers for good or evil. They choose Simon Pegg's character randomly. Um, they send him the power so now he can literally do absolutely anything at the wave of his hand. Um, and throughout the movie he wants to try to get this, um, his neighbor to be his girlfriend. However, her overbearing boyfriend, kind of... Um, Boyfriend, not really situation. Um, comes in and is trying to ruin everything. He let and he lets the dog talk. And Robin Williams wants biscuits and what? Uh, yeah. Oh, by the way, the Earthlings live at the end. So yeah, it's a fun movie. I'll just I'll just go with that. It's a fun movie. It's it's a pretty good movie. It's probably not the movie you want to remember Robin Williams for, but if he had to go off on a movie. It could have been a better movie, I'll give it that. But at least he went out with a pretty decent movie, a fun movie. So, yeah. Yeah. Um, that's really all I can say. It's a good, fun movie. Uh, it's, like, it's similar to Bruce Almighty or Evan Almighty, where you have a character who can do whatever he wants, just with a wave of a hand, and that's it. So, yeah. Um, the acting is pretty good. The voice acting is pretty good. I'll give it that. The, the acting as a whole is pretty good. It's just the situation that's kind of stupid, in my opinion. It's a story time. Because um, he can literally do anything. And they really don't touch base that much on it, to be honest. And I think the most blaring scene, I guess, or like most glaring scene where you see where he doesn't do anything when he can is the fact that he has the den uh, he lets the dog, dog speak English. And after that, he has his door. Um, his neighbor who comes up. Um, his neighbor comes up, and they're are they're asking each other, you know, what's going on or whatever. Um, or they're talking about what's been going on for the past couple of days. And all of a sudden, they Dennis becomes a plumber, or Simon Pegg says that the dog is a plumber, plumber, and apparently the plumber is gay. And um, I would have just been like, dog, shut up, and the dog will shut up. But now he just lets kind of lets it continue. So, yeah, I mean, it's, for what it is, it's good. It's, it has some pretty decent humor. I just feel like the situation could have been portrayed better. Um, so, yeah, I mean, the it's a pretty fun film, pretty decently written, pretty decently acted. It's just the situation could have been better as a whole. 
Let's so see, yeah, that's basically it for now. Um, for it. On a scale of scale 1 to 10, 1 being the worst, 10 being the best, and 6 being decent, I'll give it a 6 out of 10. It's a pretty decent film. And yeah, that's basically it for now. Subscribe if you're not subscribed. I do movie reviews, TV show reviews, and comic book reviews. Comment down below on your thoughts on the movie. Have you seen it? And if not, why not? And if you have, what are your thoughts on it? Comment on that down below. Let me know. Like the video, share on Facebook, Twitter, MySpace, or whatever it is for. And that's basically it for now. This is Daniel Mart signing off.